Yo. You guys like video games? This isn't gonna be a super long video by any means because I spent like three, four hours just waiting in line to meet voice actors, but that was so worth it. A voice of Sonic, I don't know if you maybe even know who I am or if that would be. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Okay, it's, otherwise I'm a grown man standing in front of the Green Hill Zone and, and nobody I'm, knows and what we're doing. Too. Yeah, exactly, it's like why, why are we even here? Now that I'm done with that, I'm just, oh, these are magnets. Well, like I said, um, I'm not planning to make this anything super crazy. I don't know if I'm even buying anything here. I just wanted to kind of document this because it's uh, it's fun. And I, I met the voice actors from Mario and Sonic. Like that was the goal for today and I, I, I hit it. I did. I'm only really here the last day. So it's like everything is about to shut down because I have like an hour and a half left of walking around. I spent the rest of the day in line to meet Mario and Sonic Lake. I like walking around. This is cool. Like, there's so much here. It's like the biggest retro store I've ever seen in my life. And that's cool. Am I going to buy anything here? Probably not, but, you know, maybe. It's like the only place that I know has like an actual store around here. Like, I've been to that place and it's here. That's funny to me. Oh my god, it's Sonic Forces! You know what? Actually, I wonder if we can find a good condition copy of Sonic Forces on PS4. I'm gonna look for that. I will, uh, I will update. Nothing here. Nothing over here either. Yeah, so I sold Sonic Forces PS4 a while ago. Like, I know it showed up in one of my other videos, but um, I sold it a while ago to get money for uh, something else because I already had the game. But uh, now I kind of want it to make a video essay on it. I want it to be as graphically good as it can be. So, yeah, that's, that's my reasoning. It's not great, but it's a reasoning. Wait a minute, I just found Captain Alex. That's so cool. Like, I met Captain Alex here. Like, I've been following his Instagram for years, and he just is there. I, uh, I bought a pin, because I wanted to buy something from here just to have, and, uh, Mario Pro Controller pin. I'm a Mario fan. What did you expect? They got Mario Galaxy. Let's go! They're playing the song! Woo! Bro, hearing the Mario Galaxy theme gives me life. Like, that huge, huge deal. Ba, ba, ba. Oh, that's a lot of Pokemon cards. Wow. Holy shit, it's neon white. Whoa. I knew there was something I was forgetting. I forgot my 3DS. Dude, I will never be able to afford that. Do you remember last time when I did the Riptide vlog and I, uh, I saw that Metroid 3DS at Retro for like 500? There's nothing here either. No. Crazy frog. It's like every time. I think. I think without fail, every single time that I've walked past Charles Martinet's booth after like I actually met him was like the, the galaxy music is playing. It's a sign. It's a sign. I'm telling you. A sign of what exactly? I have no idea, but galaxy is peak fiction and I will stand by that for the rest of my life. See, what's really funny to me is getting the GameStop like DS holders. These are the exact same things. So I didn't find Sonic Forces, but I got this cool pin the other way that I got this cool pin. And uh, I got to take pictures with a bunch of people. That was sick. That was so cool. Um, yeah. They're starting to close things up now, I think. They think it ends at 5. It's like 4.30 right now. So I'm just taking one last lap around just to kind of see what's going on one last time. And then I'm getting out of here because I want to go No, I can't escape it. No. They might get me with this game card holder. It might. They might get me with this. Oh. Look at this. It's so cool. This is actually like... I, I want this, but I'm... You think you don't know if you're ever gonna see something again, and then you see, like, all of it. Like, they just, they have the GameStop posters here. <laughs> I keep telling myself I'm gonna leave, and then I just see more and more cool shit. Like, that's in Tears Collector's Edition. I own it, but it's still really cool to see at events like this. That's awesome. Oh, 3D All-Stars, too. Wow. 125 holy sh dude i haven't seen a skylander in box in years look at look at eyebrow event was great for the one day i got to go i met the voices of mario and sonic that was like my main goal that was awesome and uh i met failboat which is cool i met um captain alex which is cool shout out to the two people in line with me uh while we were waiting to meet charles we just talked the entire line it was like 40 minutes we were waiting, but um, yeah, that was awesome. I'm glad I'm kind of like expanding and going to more things because this stuff is awesome. I love stuff like this. And even if it's only for a Sunday, it's still a great time. Just walking around and seeing what these things have to offer 
is such a cool feeling. Like, I'm I'm part of this. This is like the, I I get to experience this, and there's so many other people doing the same. Like, that's awesome to me. That's so cool. I love video games, and this is just a con for video games. So, uh, ooh, Sonic music. Hold on. I think the thing I'm the most upset about from this is uh, I forgot to bring my 3DS. I Every time, every time without fail, I just forget to bring it. Swear to God, if I forget my 3DS at SmashCon this year, I am going to lose it. But yeah, that's gonna do it. I'm going home. Um, I'll be at SmashCon this year though, and Riptide again. So you'll probably get vlogs of both of those. Why did I park so far? But for now, this was fun. Uh, thanks for watching. I still cannot close out videos, so bye.